Hey everybody, Rob here for Southwest Florida Television. It's about 9 o'clock Thursday morning. This is going to be my beach report for North Naples, Florida. I'm on Vanderbilt Beach, just north of the La Playa. Beautiful out here right now. Water's looking great. Air temperature 78 degrees. Gonna get up to around 92 here in North Naples. Supposed to see some clouds later today. There's been a few clouds already rolling through. Water temperature 79, no red tide. This morning's beach report is brought to you by our friends at Sluncha Irish Whiskey. Sluncha means cheers in Irish. It's a toast. Cheers, Sluncha, the toast of Ireland. We did see sea turtle nest number 29 on the beach this morning up at the north end of Vanderbilt Beach. I don't exactly know how many nests there are. I don't know how many they might have found south of that this morning, but I do know there's at least 29. So that's good news. Look at that water, gorgeous. I gotta get my feet wet here. Give you a look at it, man, beautiful. Not quite as green as that water down on Key Waden Island that we saw yesterday, but it's still beautiful. Not quite the same as Key Waden, but still nice. Look at that blue sky. That sun is bright. Come around. I have seen some red drift algae. Just a few little patches of it here in the water. Primarily right up here where I'm at, just north of La Playa. So I think it's slowly drifting away. The berm is complete. They are done with the sand berm project on Vanderbilt Beach. They're, now they're down on Pelican, on the beach of Pelican Bay down to the south. That is a separate contract. That is a private contract with Pelican Bay. They're just putting more sand on their beach. So they still have the equipment at the entrance to Vanderbilt Beach Park, on the south end of Vanderbilt Beach by the Ritz and parking garage. They're hoping to be out of there by tomorrow. That'd be awesome. That would be awesome. Saturday, maybe at the latest. So that is good news. Get our beach back. We'll be back in November though. Back in November to widen our beaches. That's gonna be a long project. They said unfortunately it's probably gonna spoil Christmas for a lot of people who wanted to spend their holidays on the beach. The beach will be open. It's gonna have to deal with the trucks again. Another quick reminder, Del Norwegian's Pass State Park. Opening Monday morning, 8 a.m. Parking lots one and two only. Parking lots one and two only at Del Norwegian's. If you don't have a park pass, they'll have pay stations in the parking lots. You won't be paying at the ranger station, so it's kind of an honor system. Do the right thing, be honorable. I'm sure it's gonna fill up very fast. See those little dark patches? That's some of that red drift algae out there. It's just been hanging in this one spot. I don't know why. For a week. Everywhere else it's going away. Weird. Hey, hit that share button. Let your friends know what's going on here at our beach. Share our little piece of Tropical paradise with them. At least it's paradise and not eyes. A thank you to our friends at Slancha Irish Whiskey for allowing me to bring these moments to you. Thank you, Slancha. Visit their website at slanchawhiskey.com.
Hey, until next time, stay safe, stay healthy, and stay strong. Tally ho, my friends, tally ho. For Southwest Florida Television, I'm Rob Stan. God bless.